I've got a secondary nest, third one on that window, fourth one on that window, fifth one on this soffit, sixth one on the peak, seventh above the wire, eighth on that soffit there, nine, a gigantic one. It's blowing my freaking mind how many areas I've got to penetrate with a fog to kill these things. This is the worst wasp job I've seen in 25 years. I mean, this place is infested. Red wasps have no redeeming value. You can't make candles out of them. They don't produce honey. They're really not good pollinators. They sting, hurt, cause uh, medical and property damage. Like cockroaches and fire ants, they're a plague. I just kill them. There's no point in relocating that nightmare anywhere. So I'm gonna attach this pyrethrin can to the tip of a pole. That way it can reach the top echelons of the house without having to get too close and get stung. The pyrethrin's gonna attack the wasp nervous system, ultimately killing them. It's time for some unholy retribution. Oh yeah. I've never seen this many red wasps on a house. If I was on a ladder, oh my God, I'd just be getting tore up. This pole idea really bailed me up. Well, just as I say that, here they come. Oh, they got me. I gotta stay, I ain't giving up, man. If I give up, that many more to live. God, just keep pouring out of there. Watching them drop out like coins in a slot machine just makes my freaking day, man. All right, good. I have wrecked the outer perimeter, but the problem isn't solved. I saw a lot of them retreating into the heart of this attic. This pole's not gonna help me up there. Here we go. It's a big bad wolf. Oh my god.